Hey everyone, I just got an article from a brother in the faith uh, in regards to uh, something that the uh, Seventh-day Adventist Church is doing, or the Ninth Hour Church uh, that Prophecy speaks of. The reason I'm posting this is because uh, there's so many Seventh-day Adventists out there that do not believe that the Seventh-day Adventist Church was prophesied to fall into the arms of the Roman Catholic Church and become a sister to fallen Babylon. Uh, it's all over the scriptures, it's all over spirit of prophecy it's it's everywhere and this is one of the reasons i uh created this page on um it's a sister to my main site here at remedygod.org if you go to the links page uh and you scroll down to uh, sda apostasy you come to this site and uh it's got quite a bit of information in regards to the uh, the downfall of the seven day adventist church just as prophecy predicted and uh but you got to see this article this just came out. Well, I don't know exactly when this came out. Let's see. Uh, April 13th, actually. This was last year or so. But I just got this the other day from uh, a brother in the faith, like I, like I said. But the headline reads, of course, Alexian Adventist have a new name for their joint venture. And if you scroll down, you'll see that they're calling it Amita Health. It says here on the top that uh, Meet Amita Health, the new name for or the new name of the joint operating company formed by Alexian Brothers Health System and Adventist Midwest Health. And if you scroll down a little further, you'll see that it says Alexian is part of St. Louis-based Ascension Health, the largest Catholic hospital chain in the country. Adventist is part of Altamonte Springs, uh, Florida-based Adventist Health System. So there you have it. And uh, it's a lot worse than people think because uh, a lot of people don't seem to, especially when I first started in ministry, uh, as a Sunday keeper even, I was telling people that the uh, Roman Catholic Church was and still is involved with the pharmacies of the world, not just America, but all the world, and uh, uh, and it's prophesied to be as such. And um, But it wasn't until a few years ago, and I think I got it here, RCC Exposed, and you scroll down to Horrific, and then you go down to Big Pharma, and you check this out. And uh, right there in Revelation 18.23, it does say that this evil church will be involved in sorcery. And sorcery, defined, is the word pharmakia, and that's where we get our modern term pharmacy. Well, they were caught big time in a criminal conspiracy between the Crown of England and the Federal Court of uh, Canada. And so that's why I posted this page some years ago. I don't remember when. Uh, okay, it was 2012. And so for the Seventh-day Adventist Church, who at one time used to declare the Roman Catholic popes of Rome to be the men of sin and the, and the Vatican to be the house of Antichrist, as prophecy predicted, they would join hands with Rome and become a sister to fallen Babylon. And uh, this is one of the many smoking guns that declare that this is indeed a prophesied fact and now a fulfilled fact. Thank you for watching. God bless.